Hello everybody, let us look at technical view on the equity market. Nifty opened on positive note today, however couldn't sustain in the positive territory. Especially in the second half of the session, it faced selling pressure and as a result, uh, it, uh, it has fallen towards its 20 daily simple moving average and at the end of the day, it has closed near that crucial moving average. In terms of price pattern, it has formed a triangular pattern and uh, last leg of the pattern uh, seems to have formed in today's session. So uh, uh, here on 5800, 5775, which is the swing low, will now act as a crucial support zone. And as long as that holds, uh, we are expecting this triangular pattern to break out on the upside. And from short term perspective, Finance 1.6, which is 61.8% retracement of the previous 5 wave decline, and 6000, which is close to Delhi Upper Bollinger Band. These are crucial levels to watch out for from short term perspective. The Delhi momentum indicator is also in sync with our bullish view. Moving on to early chart, we can see the triangular formation on the early chart clearly. In today's session, uh, Nifty has fallen down towards lower end of the pattern and which has completed last leg that is wave E of the triangular pattern and here on it is expected to start a fresh move on the upside. Uh, the daily moment, uh, the early momentum indicator has also completed its correction cycle towards the equi equilibrium line and here on it can start a new cycle on the upside. So uh, we are expecting uh, Nifty to move up till 5916,000 6, from a short term perspective. Moving on to Bank Nifty, uh, we can see that Bank Nifty after forming a 5 wave decline is in pullback mode. However, the pullback is breaking up into lower degree waves and currently uh, we are witnessing a consolidation uh, which is likely to break out on the upside. Uh, on, the, uh, on the upside, 20 DMA is uh, acting as a crucial resistance. Uh, which is around 11,600. Once this crucial moving average is, cro average is crossed, uh, the index can move up towards its Delhi upper Bollinger Band, which is close to 12,100. The Delhi momentum indicator is in bullish mode uh, and uh, suggesting further upside potential. Crucial supports to watch out for are 11,180 and 11,000. Crucial resistances are 11,450 and 11,770. Now we'll have a look at a couple of stocks which are showing bullish setup. And the first one is uh, Kotak Bank. As can be seen from this chart, after forming a basing triangle, Kotak Bank has broken out on the upside and currently it is trading near its crucial daily moving averages. It can consolidate near these crucial moving averages for a day or two. However, overall it is expected to head towards its Delhi upper Bollinger Band. The Delhi momentum indicator has also triggered bullish crossover. Crucial supports to watch out for are 710 and 690. Crucial resistances are 740 and 760. The next one is uh, Tata Power. Uh, Tata Power has also formed a basing triangular pattern and is looking for a breakout on the upside. It has uh, taken support near its crucial daily moving averages and is bouncing from these uh, moving averages. So uh, again in case of Tata Power, initial target on the upside will be Delhi Upper Bollinger Band which is close to 90.50-91 levels and uh, overall the stock possesses potential to surpass even that uh, Delhi Upper Bollinger Band and can even uh, stretch higher. Crucial supports to watch out for are 84 and 80 and crucial resistances are 89 and 96. Thank you.